105. McKinney, you think we should go and get started? Yep. All right, very good. Well, good evening, everyone. Um, if you would mind um, sharing your lovely faces, again, not required, but <laughs> I would love to see as many of your faces as possible. Um, thank you all. Hey, Hayes, how you doing there? Hey, Dennis. Appreciate that. If y'all would mind just showing your lovely faces for me, I really appreciate it. If not, totally understand, it's not required. Tania, Gwen, thank you all so much. Well, we're gonna go ahead and get started if you want. Um, my name is Terrence Hood. For those of you who don't know me, I serve as Associate Director for Alumni and Student Athletes in our TCU Career Center, but I also work with Student Athlete Development, uh, Jessica Hadrick's team. So McKenna, would you mind introducing yourself as well? Yeah, for sure. Hi, guys. My name is McKenna Martin. I'm a graduate assistant in student athlete development, and I am in my first year of the higher ed master's program. All right. And so we are here talking about Horn Frogs Connect 101. And so thank you all so much for joining me. Uh, lots of teams represented, lots of majors, some may be undecided, undeclared, but no matter where you are in the whole process, we're glad that you are here. And so I want to get right into our conversation. This is not a presentation, it's really more of a conversation. And so we've had hornfrogsconnect.com since 2015, actually. Um, it's our relaunched alumni networking platform. And so if you are looking at industries or internships or needing career advice or mentorship opportunities, this platform is for you. And so up until last semester, this platform has just been for alumni to network, share job opportunities, but we just opened it up to current students, um, all the way to graduate students, faculty, staff just recently. So everyone, if you will please join me, if you are on the website already, you're welcome to join me. Um, it's hornfrogsconnect.com. Put that in the chat, just in case you are not on there. Oops, I think I gave some to McKenna. <laughs> It's hornfrogsconnect.com. And I wanna actually, before I get started, I wanna hear from you all. So I know that this is um, a required Horn Frogs Connect event, but some of you, um, if you don't mind un unmuting yourself, what prompted you to choose this session? Are you looking at finding some industry contacts, some employer contacts, some alumni contacts? What types of industries are you thinking about? You know what I'm just here to share is what inspired you to choose this particular session tonight? Anyone care to share in particular? Just wanting more information about the platform for the most part. <laughs> Sounds good, well, that works for me. So let's get right into it. McKenna, I'm gonna go ahead and share my screen, everyone. And again, please join me. Um, I'm gonna actually really be doing more of a live demo of the platform. And so again, it's not really a scripted presentation, more of a conversation. And so I, I want you all to, if you would mind joining me on hornfrogsconnect.com, go ahead and sign in with your single sign-on. If you're having any issue with signing in, I'll reach out to McKenna or myself. But this is our, again, our alumni networking platform. So if you are a current student athlete or non-athlete and you are looking to make connections with other TCU alumni in various fields, this is the place you want to be. Um, think of this as a LinkedIn for TCU. Now, I have another question. How many of you by chat or by show of hands have a LinkedIn profile? Put a yes or no on the chat for me, if you will, please. How many of you have a LinkedIn profile? Just yes or no, or working on it? It's on the construction. <laughs> I don't know what LinkedIn is. <laughs> okay, cool. I see lots of yeses. If not yet, that's totally fine. So do you have a LinkedIn profile? Just put yes, no, working on it in the chat for me, please. Okay. Good. Thank you for sharing that. Okay. Many of you do, some of you do not. So I ask that because many people have a LinkedIn profile and they reach out to people for connections. Um, sometimes it's hard to get a response. I'm not sure if any of y'all have experienced that. LinkedIn is great about people responding, but sometimes it's hard to find people to connect with. And sometimes it's hard to wait because it takes a long time for people to respond. Some people don't even check the LinkedIn profile. 
but this is our new Horn Frogs Connect platform, newly relaunched. Um, so if you go here, you sign in with your single sign-on. This is our alumni networking platform. And actually, I'm going to shift gears a bit. The first thing I'm going to do, if you come down to the main feed here, and as you see, this resembles any social media platform, but I'm going to highlight one of our alumni student athletes who just posted today. So I'm going to actually, right in the middle here, Adam McAdoo is a former student athlete. I'm going to go read more. And if you're logged in, you should be able to see this. I'll make it a little bit bigger. McKenna, can everyone, can you see that for the most part? Or? Okay. So I'm going to actually highlight Adam here. Adam McAdoo is a former athlete. He talks about kind of where he's from when he just recently graduated. He is working at TTI right now, Tektronic Industries. And as you see here, they're hiring a ton um, of people right now because they work in the power tools industry. So due to the pandemic, people are fixing up their homes and doing lots of projects. Um, Adam is a marketing event specialist. So if anyone is curious about marketing or sales or want to learn more about TTI, as you see here, Adam has been very, very willing to share with you. So if you want to just check, check out Adam's profile, um, you can go right to his name here and learn a little bit more about Adam. This is how all of their profiles look on Horn Frogs Connect. So look up here. This is what Adam is willing to help with. So the thing that distinguishes this from LinkedIn is from this profile, we have about 6,000 alumni on this profile, on this platform, and about 85% of them have willingly raised their hand to say, I'm willing to help other students, other alumni. So here it's very clear to see what Adam can help you with. He wants to be a resource for student athletes, help you find internships, do a resume review. So every alumni, well, again, 85% of those who have registered has says, I am willing to help other students or alumni with their job search, with their career search. So now my view looks a little bit different since I'm an admin. So you might not see everything on your screen because I'm an admin, it may look a little bit different on your side. So here's more about Adam's profile here. Um, you can see when he graduated, he's a Neely student, graduated last year, track and field athlete. Here's some questions here about his experience. And Adam was actually one of 40,000 applicants to be selected as a Nike intern in 2019. <laughs> Pretty cool stuff, if you ask me. <laughs> Nike is very, very selective. So if you, hey, I wanna work at Nike, I wanna pick Adam's brain about what it's like to work at Nike, you can totally use this platform for that connection opportunity. If you come down here, here's Adam's email address. He's provided that to at the bottom. And here's the website, the TTI's website for job hosting. So if you're looking for an internship in marketing, sales, or management, or just want to connect with Adam for more advice about his Nike experience, here's the place you want to be. And anytime you have questions, please use the chat or just interrupt me. I'll mute yourself. I'm more than happy to answer more specific questions, but I want to give you a quick little demo here. And then for Adam's profile here, you go to message. If you wanted to reach out to Adam directly, and just type a little bit of a message about who you are. Um, so my name is McKenna Martin. I am a current student here at TCU and I'm curious about your experience at Nike. I would love to connect with you for a 10 minute conversation. It's that simple. So who you are, why you wanna connect, action items, name, your major, your sport. Why do you wanna connect? I wanna learn more about TTI or more about your experience at Nike as an intern. I would love to connect with you for 10 minutes over Zoom, over video. So you can send that here and it goes right to Adam's email. Let's see, connect with people. Oh, Reagan, great question. Do you have to connect with people first before viewing their profile? You do not. All profiles are open to all students, so you don't have to do any type of connection request, like a LinkedIn. That's what also makes it different. You can go right to their profile and message any alumni directly. So Reagan, I hope that answered your question. Let me know if I need to clarify anything, but thank you for asking that. It's a great question. You don't have to do any connection requests here. All these profiles are visible from day one. And also here, there's a video chat option here that's fairly new. So I want to talk to Adam over video. You can go to the schedule feature here and send Adam an invite right from the platform. So I want to meet with Adam hopefully this Friday, let's say around 6 p.m. Hopefully he's available, but we'll find out. I'll do it for, let's say about 30 minutes. And I would love to meet with him right here back on this platform or Google Hangout, maybe a phone call. Um, possibly a Skype, give it a topic here. 
just do career advice or what have you, give us a little bit of context, what you want to learn more about, and do a send invitation. It's that simple. Adam gets a notification. And then whenever you are on the platform, you go right to video chat. It takes you right to TC's video chat platform on Horn Frogs Connect. So again, this is someone who actually wants to help be a resource for student athletes. So reach out to Adam. He's a super nice guy. I always wanting to help other athletes. So please feel free to reach out to him directly. So I want to show you that as a, a cool little highlight. Adam just posted today. So as you see here, um, we have our job postings here on the right. Now all of these jobs, most of the jobs filter from Handshake. So many of you have been on Handshake, but if not, Handshake is our main platform for part-time jobs, internships, full-time jobs, career events, all of it lives on Handshake. So most of the jobs you see here come from Handshake. There's a couple of internships sprinkled, out, sprinkled around there. It's mostly full-time positions. So if you don't see what you want on here, please go right back to Handshake for your internship search or part-time jobs or on-campus job search as well. We have 129 new members, so we're still growing. And I'm gonna come over here to the directory first. So the first thing I wanna do a quick little demo of that. So here's your main directory, guys. We have over 6,200 alums registered on this platform right now. But over here on the right side, and I invite you to join me if you're on the platform, you can filter directly by affiliation. Faculty, staff, here's a former athlete filter. So if you're a former athlete or you're a current student athlete, you wanna find someone that's an alum, you can go right to this, click on that, and it filters down for you. So we have over 680 that are former athletes that are on this platform. And look at all these that are willing to help. Willing to help, willing to help, willing to help, <laughs> willing to help, it just keeps getting better and better. All of these former athletes, alumni are willing to help. So I'll just go to Devante Abrams profile here if you want to learn more about him. He's a men's basketball player, wanted to network and meet new people. He actually is in the midst of starting his own business. And up here, it shows you what you can, what he's offering help with, open doors at a workplace, advice, internships, and professional connections. Most jobs are filled through networking and relationships. So the old way of applying online, waiting to see what happens, it's not always the most effective way to find a job these days. I saw an article that said only about 5% of these click online, wait and see, actually turn into interviews. So about 5% of those types of applications yield results, but 85% of jobs are filled through networking, connections, alumni, colleagues, faculty, staff, people that you already know. So in see networking as a relationship mindset. That's why this platform is so important. You wanna start building connections with people that can get you a foot in the door or just give you insight and advice about the industry or about the company itself. So I'm gonna go back to my directory here. So this is um, Devante Abram. So here's my athletic search here. So I wanna actually ask the, um, athletes here, if you have a certain industry in mind, type it in the chat. I would love to do a demo of that industry here live, um, but if not, you're welcome to do it if you're logged in here. So I'm gonna go down here to work experience. So if you have a company in mind, you can type it in the chat. I'm happy to demo it for you live, but I'll just choose, um, I'll just do PepsiCo here. Let's see. So work experience, I'm gonna type in the company PepsiCo. All right, and if you have a company in mind, please share with me. So we have two alums here that are former athletes that have PepsiCo as part of their career path. Now, Kenny Thompson actually um, used to work for the Obama administration. He's up in Washington, DC. And so I know him personally, he's been to some of our career events at TCU. So with Kenny, you can click on his, pro, again, his profiles here. This is what, now my profile is a little bit different, but up here you should be able to see what he's offering help with. Mine says seeking help because I'm logged in as an admin. So again, your view might be a little, little bit different than mine, but he's in the Washington DC area. A little bit about Kenny's profile. He's in global public affairs, um, strategic communication. Um, he's currently at PepsiCo, leading their building, maintaining signature partnerships. 
a little bit more about his skill set. He was an Ad Rand College graduate, 2003. And he was a baseball player when he was here. You see that down here at the very bottom. And then here's a little bit of a picture of his resume. And so he, again, the White House Special Assistant. So he used to work under President Obama. Pretty cool stuff. He has a really neat story. He loves to help other athletes. So feel free to reach out to Kenny directly. Again, you can do that by message again, do a direct message with Kenny, a quick message about who you are, your name, your major, why you wanna connect with him, or we can go to the schedule meeting and schedule something via video chat, Skype, et cetera. So it's really that easy. Here's your directory here. All of our alumni are here. You can see who's willing to help. You can go by company. I'm gonna actually go back here to the directory, start over here and do one more search by industry. And then I'm gonna open up to see if we have any questions so far. So here's your main directory, everyone. Over here is where you can filter on the right. Um, let's see, I'll do work experience and then I'll do industry. So if anyone has an industry, I can totally do a demo of that, but I just wanna show you what's possible. I'm gonna come down here. And if you're online, please try it for yourself. Feel free to do that. I'm going to actually do, I'll do financial services just for this demo here. So you click on any industry or job function and we have over 150 that work in financial services. Now I didn't click on former athlete, I just did the industry by itself. But you see all these individuals here are willing to help other frogs. So play with the filters, filter by industry or job function, and then reach out directly to those alums for industry specific questions. Now I would recommend not connecting, just help me find a job. Now, obviously that's the end goal, but try to approach from the fact to learn more about what you do, to learn more about your experience. And the more you establish that rapport, it'll be easy for them to refer you. So the ask isn't help me find a job right now, right now it's help me learn more. And as you learn more, they'll get a sense of what you're looking for, even if you're undecided. I'm curious about Nike. I'm curious about financial services. I want to connect with the two alumni this week that can give me some insights, some information, or some referrals. I had an alumni recently who uh, reached out to um, someone who works at Bell Helicopter because they had internships at Bell Helicopter. So they used the platform. They reached out to an alumni that works at Bell Helicopter and the alumni reached right back out to them within a week and gave them someone in HR to reach out to. So it took one week to do what they've been trying to do all semester. <laughs> they try to get a contact at Bell with, hey, here's an alumni at Bell. Do you know anyone that I can reach out to? So it took that person like a week to get something done that has been taking them six months to do on their own. So use the platform, make the connections. It saves you a lot of time because the job searching, as you all know, is very competitive. Um, the economy is not what it used to be. So you really want to leverage these types of platforms to find people in the spaces that you want to work or that you want to learn more about. All right. So I'm going to go shift gears here. I'm going to go down to the groups feature here. If you have any questions, please use the chat or please unmute yourself. So again, my view looks a little bit different um, because I'm an admin, but we have about a dozen or so group. We have groups by college. So if you are in Adwin College, you can start, you can go here and join the group for Adwin alumni and students. So I wanna network with people from my college. Find your college, College of Education. Here is the Black Alumni Alliance. We have uh, Frogs in Law, Frogs in Healthcare. And then we actually have for former athletes, the Block T Association. So if you wanna find other frogs that are athletes, you can join this group for our letter winners and our former athletes. And John Denton is the leader of the group here. We have one new member, so you can come right to the members tab to see who's a part of the group. I think it's gonna be the same people that are in the main feed, the main director that gets the former athlete filter. They're gonna probably be some of the same folks in this group. So once again, you see who's willing to help, 688 of them are former athletes in the group. Do a little bit of research on what they are, what they do. And then if you want to feel to even for oh, even more, come down here to the work experience here, TCU. And then here's some more filters. You can filter by their major or their minor or their master's student, or their veteran. So here's some additional areas here 
that you're more than welcome to filter because 688 is a lot to filter through. So definitely feel free to filter this according to what your interest might be or to what you're curious about. So I wanna take this out. So here's the groups for the Block T Association. All of our former athletes are here. You again, fill it to bottom. Now the mentorship area is not fully developed yet. So I will recommend not clicking on the mentorship at this time. That's still under construction, um, but we're working with alumni relations and our student athlete development colleagues to um, build that out over time. So the mentorship piece is not quite yet done, but all the other factors on the platform should be good to go. All right. So again, go to groups. And then to come down here, again, my, my view looks a little bit different since I'm an admin. Here are other groups. And I forgot to show y'all one more thing here in the Black Tea Association, they actually have subgroups by team. So if you're an athlete, if you join the Black Tea Association, there's some subgroups here. And a few of them have created their own groups for their teams. So soccer has a subgroup, uh, women's volleyball, um, women's rifle team. So there's some mini groups inside the main Black Tea Association for you to network with alumni according to the team that they played on. So just keep that in mind here. So some of these tabs might be empty right now like some of the jobs here, that's gonna be built out over time. So this platform is a work in progress. Our main job board is our main feed that you see when you log in, that goes right to Handshake. So that'll be where I recommend looking for the jobs for now. Go back to groups here. You can come down further, here's some groups here. Um, BNSF leadership program, we have frauds in accounting. So now we have groups by industry. So I wanna work in energy or education or entertainment, financial services. Now we have groups that are set aside for certain industries for you to start networking early with people that might be working in an industry of your interest. Nonprofits, we have ranching, we have real estate, sales and marketing, technology, and then other niche specific groups for LGBTQ Alliance, our Hispanic Alumni Alliance, we have baseball, athletic training, some of the more niche subgroups here. Football has their own subgroup, <laughs> men's golf, men's soccer. So hopefully you find your team in this subgroup. But if not, I'm sure groups will be created over time. This website is something that's a work in progress. So all the um, features are 100% developed, but some of the core features are the jobs, the groups, and the directory in particular. All right. So other than groups here, we do have um, an events tab here. We have a business directory. So for Hunt Frogs, we have their own business, alumni. Um, if you have your own business, you can post here, but many of our alumni have their own business. They want people to know about it. So we're helping them to promote their business here. So please take advantage of the services. Um, there are a wide variety here from insurance to mental health services, um, real estate, consulting. So we wanna make sure that our alums can promote their businesses freely for the um, TCU Horn Frog family. And the last thing here is our resources tab here, just FYI. We have some webinars and some resources that are typically more geared to alumni, but we do have some webinars that we've done that are open to anyone. So we have time management tips for your job search, um, job search hacks with Hallie Crawford. So all these resources are open to students and alumni to view at your leisure. So that is pretty much the gist of the platform, everyone. Uh, really kind of a Horn Frogs Connect 101. Um, we have the jobs posted here, they sync from Handshake. We have a directory for you to find alumni by industry or job function or by company. Um, does anyone have any questions or concerns about the platform or would like for me to demo a certain industry to find alumni? I'm happy to do that for you, but what questions do y'all have for me? Right. We're doing great, McKenna. <laughs> All right. Well, everyone, that again is pretty much the gist of it. It's just a quick run through of some of the main features here. It's open to current students, uh, alumni, faculty, staff, grad students. So please use the platform as you see fit, make connections with alumni. Um, they're really eager to help uh, with resume reviews. Some are offering mock interviews 
open doors with our company, industry specific questions. So please take advantage of the platform here. Um, you know, McKenna and I, we are here to help you. If you have any questions or need any referrals or company contacts, but I'm going to um, stop sharing my screen at this time. It's pretty much the gist of everything. I wanted to give you all a quick overview of the platform. This is it, hornfroxconnect.com. Welcome to the platform. Anyone have any questions before we dismiss? Or